exhibition at the age of 52. Yes, I did. What did you do? I sung. I sung on television. And yeah. I'd never sung anywhere before, not even in front of family or friends. Never sung a note before? No, except to myself in the bath. Yeah. <laughs> That's all, yes. But um, there was a programme on BBC Television Primetime hosted by Roy Castle. And he asked for ideas from the viewers, something for the show. And I said, wrote and said, would he have a dream come true for a viewer? I've always wanted to sing. So my debut singing was uh, on BBC television with a 22-piece big band, <laughs> wow, wow. <laughs> which was great. It rather spoilt me, but it did whet my appetite to do more. And it didn't matter that you'd waited to the age of 52 to achieve that? No, I mean, I do feel sorry that I didn't do it earlier, I must admit. But when I was 30 and 40, I thought I was too old and wouldn't start. And then when I reached 50, I thought, well, if I don't do it now, I will never do it and I will regret it. Well, we're going to have a little look at you in action singing. Let's have a little taste of it. Ladies and gentlemen, following in the footsteps of the legendary Ella Fitzgerald, Patricia Gooch, accompanied by the BBC Big Band, conducted by Barry Forgey. And that's why the lady is a tramp. years ahead of you I, oh, think. I did I did enjoy doing that that was wonderful really. so there's no looking back for you now oh no my philosophy now is it's best to look back on your life and, gla and say I'm glad I'd done that rather than I wish I'd tried it mm -hmm. absolutely it's very good advice <laughs> yes